Almost half of the British public think Prince Harry should be stripped of his royal title following his and Meghan Markle's explosive Netflix show, New Polling Shows. A YouGov survey found 44% of respondents say the Duke of Sussex should lose his title, compared to 32% who disagree. Some 24% did not know. Meanwhile, 44% said they had more sympathy with Prince William and Kate following the bombshell six-part series earlier this month, compared to just 17% for Harry and Meghan. And 23% of respondents to the survey of 1,672 adults carried out from December 20 to 21 said it had made them think worse of the Sussexes. Only 7% said it made them think better of the couple, who are living in the U.S. after quitting royal duties in 2020. Some 33% said their opinion of Harry and Meghan was already negative and the documentary made no difference, while 13% said their positive view had not changed. Camilla's father made King cry as he ordered him to show some decency and end romance Camilla, the Queen Consort's father, Bruce Shand, reduced King Charles III to tears when he confronted him about their extramarital relationship, a royal insider claimed. The King and his now wife rekindled their relationship in the mid-1980s when they both were married and had children with different partners. Mr. Shand is said to have told Charles to show some honor and decency and end his romance with Camilla after recordings of their private phone conversations emerged. Royal author Tom Quinn told The Times, I'm only surprised that the documentary didn't do more damage to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. I found it painful to watch, it made you realize they are lost souls. It is extraordinary that they feel this will somehow improve things for them. I'm not at all surprised that people have more sympathy for the Prince and Princess of Wales because they are doing the classic thing of being stoical. They are not complaining about Harry. I think it is unlikely that the King will strip the Duke of Sussex of his title because then it looks like he and Prince William are doing the kind of things Harry and Meghan do. Their modus operandi is to be quiet and calm and not lash out. The polling also found 65% think Harry and Meghan chose to leave the royal family, compared to 11% who said they were forced out. A majority, 53%, said the couple do not deserve an apology from the royals, while 19% said they did. But 51% said the Sussexes should be invited to the King's coronation next year, with 31% saying they should not be on the guest list. It comes after Harry and Meghan made a series of fresh revelations about the monarchy in their six-hour Netflix marathon. Both Buckingham Palace and Kensington Palace have remained silent in the face of the Montecito-based pair's latest claims. But the royals are no doubt bracing for further blows with the Duke of Sussex tell all memoir looming in the new year. Harry and Meghan previously hit out at the royal family, including damaging racism accusations, in their Oprah Winfrey interview in 2021 a year after Megxit. The Sussexes are pursuing new lives of personal and financial freedom after stepping back as working royals in March 2020.